Cut up all of your wood according to the plans I showed at the beginning. First step is to attach the feet to the posts. Then you're gonna to wanna to cut your braces on 45s and attach those. Then I just got some bowls for my kitchen and used them as stencils to make the hole for the head and the wrists. One's a 13 inch hole and the other two are six inch holes. I cut them out using a jigsaw. Then I attached these support braces. Then I screwed on the lower of the two inserts. Then I attached the higher of the two. Um, I did this on purpose, staggered them so they would be easily screwed in and screwed out when I want to take it apart and put it away. So the next thing I'm gonna do is take my palm sander and sand around inside the holes so nobody gets a splinter in their face. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is, I bought one of these wire cut brush, they're called, and I'm gonna take it and hold it to the wood and try to make it look distressed. Just get a hammer. The purpose of doing it with the hammer is to make it look old and rickety and Warm. This is great stress reliever. You can, I don't know, think of like an ex-boyfriend or something. Okay, so what I did was I mixed, I put some rusty saw blades in a jar with vinegar and it turns this nasty brown color. So I'm gonna paint it on the wood and hope that it looks distressed. Okay, so I wanted to show you what is happening here. This is the before, and this is the after. If you're going to be keeping this outside, you definitely want to apply some Thompson's water seal to keep it protected so it doesn't swell up. Okay, so I bought this. It's hanging store. It was five bucks in Walmart. I don't know what it is, but it comes with these really cool, huge... Uh, metal rings and I also got this uh, five bucks for six foot of chain I got three of these I bought four but I'm gonna return one and then what I did was I took a loop with a screw end and I screwed it into the pole and I put one of those metal things on here it's like a big key ring um, and they open like that. Just put the chain on it. And then what I did was I just took a drywall screw and screwed the other end there. Um, and then I got these, our weather stripping strap thingies. Uh, they were like a dollar at Home Depot. And I just got some big hex nut bolts to put through there to make it look like it's locked in. Uh, and then I went to the dollar store and I got some skulls 
that I spray painted black and metallic silver and then I just screwed right through their head into the top of the pole. And I got my little posable prop guy. He's super happy. And that's it. Now I'm gonna bring it outside. So I took it out to my backyard, placed it on top of some pallets to make like a stage and put some lights on it. Makes a great photo op for your Halloween party. Hope you liked my video. Thanks for watching.